Dashers, long time no see. Sapphire Dasher here again. Back again with another video and back again on that DoorDash grind. Let me tell you what's been going on. Uh, for the last two months, I haven't been able to really use my personal car for much of anything due to it having um, some brake issues. Now those brakes are replaced $447 later. So we're out here doing some DoorDash tonight in lovely Ashburn, Virginia. Uh, we're just going to late, so just a simple two hour shift. So just gonna aim for $40 and uh, see what we can get. So far I've had these two sweet green orders. Uh, each order covers their miles. Uh, the first one I got while I was at home and the other one I got as an add-on as I was driving to the restaurant. So right now we are on the way to go drop off these orders. So after both drop-offs, I will be back with you guys again and check in with you and let you more, know more about what's been going on. So talk to you guys later. Hope you guys enjoy the video. Here you go. So we got that we got that uh, order dropped. The first order dropped off of three orders. Um, so we dropped off the first sweet green. Then we got an add-on for Chipotle, which is a longer route, but it's an Aldi. And it's for seven dollars, an additional four miles from the next customer. So I'm like, yeah, that's fine. I'll go ahead and take that because that's going to be uh, twenty-three dollars right in a single hour. So why not take it? So I'm taking. So I took it. <clears throat> I mean, it's just a salad. So the salads don't get don't even get any colder, and they until they don't get warm. But hopefully, uh, if, the, if the other person is watching on the app, they can see that I have multiple orders and uh, that I will get to them as soon as I possibly can. Uh, but anyways, um, that's it for now. Picking up from Chipotle. And then I'll be back with you guys after I pick up the Chipotle and talk to you guys some more. Alright guys, so we got that order picked up from, uh, from Chipotle. So, we are working our way now to our next drop-off. That's not too bad. <clears throat> um, and from here we'll work our way in 50 feet turn left onto Yukon Drive to turn the left onto Yukon order, Drive then turn right onto State Route 643 we'll see how far away that actually is when we get there oh, that's right, I guess um, so yeah Anyways, uh, what have I been up to? Why haven't there been any videos Take lately? Take the next ride onto State Route 643. Well, the answer to that's pretty simple. Um, I started a new job in July. I left my other job the week before 4th of July weekend. And I did not get paid from my new job until... Uh, basically today and I had to get caught up on some bills which in a quarter mile turn right onto Metro Center out Drive any sort of income I have um so I'm out here uh, doing some DoorDash to help bolster my income because I'm only paid twice a month from my W2 job and this should help me with other bills and stay on stay on target but uh, yeah, it's just been, I've been getting used to the new job. I, I like it. That's important, I like it. Even though it is a one year contract. Turn right but onto Metro I do Center like Drive. What I'm doing again, so that's, that's good. And uh, now that my brakes are fixed on my car, I continue on Metro to, Center Drive for half a mile. Uh, come out here and do food delivery again. So. Um, beyond that, not much else going on. Just, uh, you know, making ends meet, making extra money to help bolster the W-2 income. And, uh, 
maybe hopefully uh, increase the sub count on my YouTube channel. I like to get to, uh, I like to get to 50 subs by Halloween. That would be nice, or more. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go drop off this uh, sweet green order, and I'll be back with you guys after drop off. Talk to you soon. Okay, so we got every we got that order dropped off. I I mistook I mistook my customer's neighbor to be my customer because they were standing outside. So that was a that was a little embarrassing. So I'm just gonna get ready and turn around here. So. Working on that right now. Anyways, uh, we are on our way down to Aldi to drop off this Chipotle order because apparently there is no Chipotle in Aldi. But I like going to Aldi. It's new, it's fresh down there. Take the next ride on the Amber Run Terrace, then turn left onto Garlington Drive. I will make the drive down there for this customer. Take the next left onto Garlington Drive, then turn left onto Red Drive. So, anyways, I'll be back with you guys after I uh, drop off this order. Talk to you soon. Take the next left onto Red Drive. All right, guys, we got everything. We got the order delivered. So, oops. It's a little, it's a little wet. It's a little, little wet. <laughs> it's not too wet. It's just, it's just wet. <laughs> Anyways, uh, got that order dropped off, so we are all good there. I am uh, going to work my way back to my neck of woods. So we'll see what we can get on our way on our. I sent back into the wonderful little town of Ashburn, Virginia from the tiny little town in uh, Aldi, which has a bunch of new homes that are multi-million dollar homes. So we're going to go back to Fleetwood because that's a quicker way back into civilization I think and yeah uh, things are going well it's good to be back all right guys we got our next two orders here picking up for McDonald's the double pick up for seven dollars and fifty cents uh, but it's only going 4.9 miles and uh, the locations look close together so, of course, we'll take it. Um, I prefer doubles to be $12, because these are probably two no-tip orders that just kind of got delivered, or one's a tipped order, but very low tip, or the other, and the other one is a no-tip. Uh, we will see. But I don't mind uh, taking these orders as we're getting back into the flow of things, and they're close. Um, as long as a, as long as it's a dollar per mile, I will take the order. So, and actually, it's a little, it's a little bit more than a dollar a mile because all the miles are for me to McDonald's. So, yeah, I am uh, going to work my way to the Golden Arches, and we'll be back in a little bit. So talk to you guys soon. Hope you've been enjoying the video so far. All right, guys, we have the Golden Arches orders. So now we are going to work our way to our first customer who is less than a mile away. One of these customers decided that they wanted cookies. They were a three, they were a, a three pack of cookies from McDonald's. Y'all know how expensive that was? That, that probably was? Man, I would love to know if I had that disposable amount of income. I don't. Um, so, 
In 400 feet, turn right to stay uh, on Southern Walk Plaza. Speaking of uh, DoorDash orders, I was Take going the next to right order to stay food on from Southern Walk Plaza, today then turn left onto for lunch Drive. because my car was at CarMax uh, getting its brakes um, replaced. I put that order into DoorDash, and after after all the fees and the Turn driver left tip, onto Windridge Drive. Twenty-three dollars. Twenty-three dollars. That's double the amount of. That's double the amount that that meal at, that I get at Chick Fil A costs me. So you know what I did? Because I live half a mile away from that Chick Fil A, I walked my I walked my ass there and picked up my food. I didn't order through DoorDash, obviously, I just went there and ordered through the app like normal. But yeah, when I said it was $23, I'm like, screw that. I'd rather get, I'd rather get 2,300 steps in than pay $23. Um, so, anyways, go focus on driving. So I will catch you guys later. Alright guys, we're back. We got both those orders dropped off. And we are not taking that. Um, we are actually on a decline-a-thon right now, uh, nearing the end of our shift here. A lot of trash down here in in Ryan in the Ryan Park area. Also, I want to be careful uh, picking up anything over here because, well, actually, no, it's, I can it's safe now, but earlier. Uh, there was like a rabid cat or something. So, um, now that's that's a good order. We'll take we'll take that as our last order for the night. <clears throat> All right, so our next order here is going to be. You know what? We're going to climb that. I want to get something closer to home. I don't care if it drops me down to forty eight percent. GPS signal lost. All right, so now we're out of the high priority program. But uh, I want orders that will take me home. But I'm not seeing that. So I'm going to probably wind up ending my dash here, guys, at... <laughs> no, I don't think I will take that. I will end my dash here, guys, at $29.64. Uh, we are no longer in the high priority in a high priority pay program, but what can you do when orders are not good and you're trying to you're trying to get home? Alright, there we go. We were out for one hour and 38 minutes, we completed five deliveries and we earned $29.64. Not a good, not a good shift at all. But it is Tuesday, Tuesdays are typically slow. So, um, I'm gonna be real honest with you guys, it is getting your acceptance rate up to uh, 50% and 70% worth it in Virginia, at least in my area. Depending on your market saturation, probably not. And I probably will go back up to 50%. I'll probably be back at 50% sometime this week. Uh, but mm, when you're trying to get home and I have my destination filter set to take me home, um, yeah, it just doesn't make any sense. So, I am going to swing over here and pick up some halal guys for dinner tonight. Really good place if you're in Ashburn. Halal guys, definitely, definitely check them out. They're delicious. Um, but yeah, uh, it's, oh, this road's so close. Uh, it's good to be back, guys. It's good to be back. I hope you enjoyed the video. And I will... Uh, talk to you guys later. So you guys have a good night and uh, feel free to subscribe to the channel. I'm back.
back. So, look forward to more content.